Meanwhile, Perry hosting the Lady Commodore Spectacular. A little hail early on, but the ladies are ready to go. We'll begin in the high jump. Bar set at 4 feet 8 inches. Waynesville Goshen's Caitlin Hines clears that. She would finish in second place by an eight as Carly Marshall. Marshall clears 4 8. She would take it at 4 feet 10 inches. Discus now parries the Nautica Crockett. 64 feet 4 inches. She would finish in 10th place. Upper Scioto Valley's Catherine Moore going 75 feet 10 inches. Sixth place for Moore, Ada's Grace Nelson wins the discus. To the track now, 100 meter dash. Ridgemont, Sydney Richardson, Golden, 13.43. Ada's Annie Archer, Spencerville's Madison, Caitlin in second, third. The 800 sprint medley, a relay you see oftentimes in these early season events. USV wins, Megan Carey anchoring Ada and Spencerville going second and third. Distance event now, 1600. And it's Ridgemont's Faith Jenkins taking first. Six minutes, 24.38 seconds. Spencerville's Tori Bakke in second. Waynesfield Goshen's Janelle Case finishing in third place in the 1600. Four by 100 relay. Waynesfield Goshen taking first. Emily McKinnon, the anchor, 55.41 seconds. Bearcats eight a second and third. 400 meters, and it's Sydney Richardson, the golden go for golden again. Time of one minute, 8.33 seconds. Eight is Anna Archie in second, Central City Schaefer third. Finally, 300 meter hurdles. Upper Scioto Valley's Megan Carey takes first place, 54.24 seconds. Ridgemont's Megan Creighton second, and Waynesfield Goshen's Amelia Werner finishing in third place. As for the team results, the Ada Lady Bulldogs take home the Perry Spectacular with a nine point better day than Spencerville. Bearcats edging wins from Goshen by one. Ridgemont, one point behind the Tigers for four, so good grouping there from second to fourth.